Hello everybody, welcome for another video tutorial after more than a month. In the next video set I will tell you why I did not post anything. Yes, because of the, my health. Currently I am better so I am recording this video. Okay, so one of you viewers asked me if I can make uh, a video how to clean up your disk drive so junk files uh, delete some files that you do not need how to find them etc but to do that video first i need to tell you about what are files and folders and this video is all about that so very basic information what are they what are they stand for um the types of the files, etc. So, without further ado, let's just start, shall we? So, let's just start with the files. Later, I will talk about folders. So, files are elements on some kind of storage device. Does not matter if it is inside uh, your smartphone or tablet computer. It can be inside the desktop computer, uh, inside the television, uh, USB uh, flash key, thumb key. <laughs> Basically, you can find data on a lot of different places. Uh, but First, let me just show you on my desktop, Windows desktop, few examples of the files. So, let's jump in, right? So, here I have a bunch of different types of the files. Every single file has its own content. Uh, let's say here I have pictures, some kind of pictures that you can watch, maybe you made photos of your uh favorite people of your uh, dog whatsoever uh, then we have let's say documents then we have the spreadsheets videos if you record that maybe your pet doing some crazy stuff <laughs> program file there is also another three document files those are shortcuts to install it applications of Adobe Reader and Google Chrome, for example. Here are two compressed files. To differentiate between all those files, we differentiate by the file extension. So take a look. So let's just take this picture. Picture1.jpg. The file name is picture1. And then it is separated by the dot and the file extension is jpg. File extension uh, defines what type of the file it is. So here if we look we have dot rtf and dot dot x. Here we have dot pdf. Now you know how to differentiate between these type of the files. You may not see extensions on your computer. If you want to see them, I will just show you quickly how to do it. So, to show file extensions on all the files, we need to open up File Explorer. We can just click uh, Search or Start menu, does not matter. Type in File, click on the File Explorer. Inside here, we need to go to the View tab and file name extensions. I'm going quickly through it because this video is not about file managing and file stuff. <laughs> that is for the future video. So let's talk about the content of the files. So each file has some kind of data in it, like I already said before, but uh, there are files like text document file, which has only text inside of it. But some files like .x, that is Word document file, Word is application that you use to open .x files. <laughs> uh, 
this kind of file can have multiple types of data. Images, it can have sounds, video, uh, text, etc. <laughs> Let's say uh, video files can contain video content and also it can contain the information about the video, uh, where it was made, uh, the title, what codec was used, etc, etc, etc. There are other types of the files also, like compressed archived files, where you can put multiple files inside one file. So that is compressed file. And also you can find uh, media uh, or disk image files, where let's say if you know DVD, you can put inside one file, rip it into one file, uh, etc. There is a lot of different types that you can also find, but this video is not to go deep into all this stuff. So in each file we can have one or multiple types of data. So now let's cover the file extensions. Uh, we know a bunch of different types, but in this video, a little bit later in this video, I'll just tell you a few most common file extensions that you can find. But if you want more information, you want to learn more, you can go into the description below this video, down below, and just click on some link and just read and learn. <laughs> you can also go to uh, YouTube, search for file extensions or whatsoever. There is a lot of uh, resources on this over, over the internet. Okay. Without further ado, let's just go to the file extensions. So, for example, audio files. Most known extensions are .mp3, .wav, .wav, yeah, .wma, .m4a, .midi, .mid. <laughs> um, and so on. So next let's cover video file extensions. We can find let's say .avi, .mp4, .mkv, .flv. We can also find, yes, I am watching the list just to, so I can remember. My memory sucks. <laughs> So dot wmv dot mov dot mpg dot mpeg dot free gp etc etc etc. So next let's talk about maybe compressed types of the files, archive files, which are dot zip dot rar dot seven z dot tar dot tz. <laughs> etc. Also, let's say image. Yes, images we can find everywhere. Dot .jpg, dot .jpeg, dot .png, dot .bmp, dot uh, what else, tif or tif, <laughs> tif or tiff, <laughs> uh, let's say Photoshop, if you're using Photoshop, want to use Photoshop program, then you can use .psd. Adobe Illustrator program is for .ai, etc. So next, let's talk about spreadsheets, file types. Spreadsheets, you know, you can type in the, all of the data that you, let's say for training, or you can make a bill, the program like uh, Microsoft Excel can calculate all of the informations for you, so it is easier for you, etc. So, file types, the old one is .xls, uh, the new one that is used for many, many years now is .sl, ah, 
Demet. Dot X L S X. You can also find dot o, o D S etc. So next, let's say text document file. One of the most popular is dot txt. Only text inside. You can also find dot log. Word processor extensions, document other document extensions. Let's say few most uh, popular are dot docx. Previously, it was dot uh, doc. Doc. <laughs> uh, also dot pdf dot rtf dot wpd etc 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 and let's also cover shortcuts let's say let's jump into the computer we have here for acrobat reader google chrome but here i do not see the extensions because windows hides them by default and those files has file extensions dot l n k another let's say for website shortcut is dot url let's uh, cover the last types of file extensions for today which are executables programs you know so one of most popular are dot exe which you can find bunch of different programs on the computer that you open up executable exe file and you can play game you can uh, open word document whatsoever others are like dot msi dot uh, jar for java scripts yeah let's say on android operating system you can find dot apk etc 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 so until now i was talking about the files now let's talk about the folders so folders are a much simpler thing they are used to contain the files and they are used uh, for sorting all the files you know let's say file text file you can put inside the folder close it and that's it you know what let's represent this inside the computer so here i have a bunch of different files i can create a folder just somewhere empty right mouse button click go new and click on folder so i can type in let's say we can do documents when we are done enter key on the keyboard you can now just select all the documents and just move it inside the documents. If I let's say open documents, you see all the files inside. Remember that in this video I'll be not talking about file managing. Uh, how to manage your files, documents, etc. This is a topic for one of my future videos. So that was files, folders. You know, there is a bunch more information that I could tell you. But this is basic video. So that's it. So yeah, that was it for today. I hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, did not understood something, tell me something new. Say hi whatsoever. Type everything below in the comment section. Of course, don't forget to subscribe, click bell icon, notify all, so you get all notifications about new, my new videos when I post. Of course, if you like the video, big thumbs up, if you did not, thumbs down and share with others so others can learn also. And until next time, have a blessed people, bye bye!